Hi, my name's David Waring and I'm head of the Marine and Trade Group at Hill Dickinson. The second anniversary of my appointment to that role is rapidly approaching and I thought it might be helpful to review the progress that we've made within the group over that period. I was appointed to the role in the very unfortunate and unforeseen circumstances of the loss of my colleague Maria Petordis. At that time the firm decided to make the role a full-time appointment indicating the real commitment that the firm had to the marine sector and to the various teams that we operated in that field. The brief was quite simple. One, increase the capability and strength in depth within the specialist teams in the UK. And secondly, to increase the overall operating scale of the three international offices in Piraeus, Hong Kong and Singapore. To that end, we set about on a strategic recruitment campaign. In the UK, into the shipping team, we were fortunate to recruit Siri Duddington and Tom Burdus from CJC. We also recruited Beth Bradley from Clyde's and Kevin Austin from Norton Rose. In the commodities team, we were able to recruit Mark Aspinall and Paul Sinnott from Eversheds and John McAnally from Reed Smith. In the international offices, we set about pulling together an international ship finance capability. We were fortunate in acquiring Jason Chauhan's team from Holman, Fenwick and Willem and SD Choi and his team from Norton Rose in Singapore. Added to that, we recruited Anthony Cowie in Hong Kong. On the litigation side, we also recruited Edward Liu from Reed Smith in Hong Kong. And finally, in commodities, we recruited Sumit Malhotra, who was in-house counsel with the Noble Group and who joined us into our Singapore office. These recruits contributed hugely to the growth of the Marine and Trade Group as a whole. Over the two-year period, turnover has increased by around 20%. And very pleasingly, in the international offices, turnover has increased by around 50%. This growth has provided us with a very strong financial platform to take the development of the Marine and Trade Group forward in the future and to enable us both to attract the best talent and to retain that talent once in Hill Dickinson.